Uh, yeah, it's Monday Night Raw. Nope, sorry, wrong day. Tuesday Night Smackdown. I'm gonna confuse Raw and Smackdown. Smackdown is so much better. Oh, that was fun, the wrestling. Hey, Ross, how are you? Hey, Sam, welcome. I'm glad. Picking it up. Not it for three oh, very good, thank months. you, Sam. I'm sorry, I just wasn't sure how you could. Thank you. It's not, uh, how come you couldn't make it last night anyway, Sam? Hello everyone and welcome to SmackDown Live! Oh, New World! Don't you dare be sour! Clap for your world famous Ah, oh, me too, Sam, me too. I hope he, I hope he does a speedy recovery and we can see him again on our screens. Just so I can go back to hate our bin my phone up. Just so when he comes back and he kicks down to the ass, he can come back and I can continue to hate him. Until then, best of luck to Roman slash Joe. I'm behind you 100%. One thing that Biggie pleasantly left out in his announcement is that the new they are now the former SmackDown Tag Team Champions after the events of the 1,000th episode of SmackDown Live last week. Just had to remind us, Tom, I was trying to ignore that fact. Well, Sexton, considering it's your job to know the facts, I'm not surprised. Nonetheless, Big E, Kobe Kingston, and Xavier Woods thrilled here in front of the WWE Universe. But let's take you back to what happened last week on the 1,000th episode of SmackDown Live. A tag team title opportunity yeah. for the bar of that so much trouble with the New Day, but... Damn, bro. I was just having a nap for about an hour and a half. I woke up at 12. The face pizza fucking mess in there. Hey, awesome. Kofi Kingston, who would be unceremoniously deposited through the announced table at ringside. Well, no, but it looked like he was there to help Kofi Kingston. Biggie realized he will, Sam. Um, Big Show had done, and it was Sheamus who had capitalized with a malicious broken kick and capture the SmackDown Tag Team titles. For himself, Cesaro, and the ball gentleman has now been raised. I still don't understand this association between the bar and the big show. Oh, yeah, what? Well, I don't see him realistically making that much of a quick recovery there, off to be honest. Nice, awesome, though. Best of luck, mate. I could see him possibly throwing back after WrestleMania, probably back in the next year. Cancer battles are normally quite lengthy, so I don't see it. To see him realistically being in the Royal Rumble. Last week, your boys, the New Day, were cheated and defeated by the bar for our tag team championships. They didn't just set the bar, they lowered the bar. And we get it, man. Look, we're competitors. They took advantage of the situation. That's what they do. Hello? That's what they do. They took advantage of the situation. But what I'm having a hard time wrapping my mind around is just... 
Big Show? Bro. Big Show. Big Show? Bro. Big Show. Big Show. That's right, Sam. Yeah. Bro. Big Show? Big Show. You know, he's in the prime of his wait, life, wait, 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 and hopefully he can recover so does and that take make him and kick it ass. Tender? Get it, get it, get it. Tender, yeah, get it was a pretty yeah, decent show. That was great. That was great, Woods. That was great. Thank you. Man, Big Show, we thought you were cool. We all thought you were cool. But this grizzly seven-foot goof flips back and forth more times than a flapjack. Oh. So tonight, I want all the smoke. I want some payback, some retribution, some get back. So whether it's Cesaro, whether it's Sheamus, or whether it's Big Show, I really don't give a damn. Tonight, somebody is getting that. I think the heel turn for, uh, for Dean was pretty cool. I will do soon, mate. Oh no, it's fine, Sam. In this instance, I will allow you the swearing, mate, because cancer can just fuck right off. So yes, mate, we're all very passionate and we're all behind Roman Reigns in this situation. Yeah, mate, I'll allow you to get carried away on this situation. It's very difficult. Also, no! You're right. Exactly, mate. Cancer gets ass kicked and Roman will be back. But for now, we just have to make sure Roman is not forgotten. We are here for him. Thank you, Roman. It's not been said tonight yet. Thank you, Roman. He, I'm, I may have hated his character, but he was one of the damn hardest workers in WWE for the last seven years. Oh, it doesn't surprise me that some people are being dicks about it, Ross. Fucking wankers. They're sad, pathetic fucking humans that don't have any sympathy until something happens to them and then they expect every person to fucking care about them. But don't show anything towards anybody else. Exactly, Sam. Hello! Am I the only one that realizes there are three members of the New Day? Yes. The point? What are you talking about? Byron's over there crying and belly aching because Big Show's out here to even the odds. But somehow, it's not fair to the New Day. Well, guys, it looks like Kofi Kingston is going to start this off for the New Day. It looks like he's ready to go. And now uh, uh, Sheamus is in the ring, so it looks like we'll, we'll get Kofi Kingston. Oh, mate, Kingston honestly, everyone would want to go. I'd want to go play all those crap. Unfortunately, Sam, it's a scenario that could happen, mate. He's got a pretty high survival rate, but he's still got a small possibility of dying. That is the sad reality of it, mate. Which is why it is one of the most heartbreaking and disgusting diseases in all the fucking world. The bell never officially rang it. There it is. So this is what it is. Big Show and Kofi Kingston. Your one-on-one -on -one matchup between the Bar and the New Day. Seems only appropriate. Oh, oh man. man. God. There is absolutely no way Kofi Kingston 100% after being driven through the table last week. Cesaro over here talking. Feels very confident about this one. And why wouldn't you? Big Show is six-time world champion. He's backing up in your corner. And now, Grace, your point. Oh, oh here's the situation New Day's never encountered. Even numbers. Phil, if I wasn't listening to you talk, I was listening to Sheamus and Cesaro. They're out oh, my God. Spouting the oh, truth. God. It's like a party for these two now. Oh, got the Big Show. Byron, for the last year, you came out here week after week and fanboyed for the New Day, and everything they did oh, no. was no, right. No, 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 no,
Kofi felt this last one. Exactly. Canvas. What's wrong with your friend off the night, mate? Even the score. Oh, come on. Oh, it's not fair. Yeah, show's not done it's yet. not over. Oh, and another choke slam. Don't ignore me, Saxon. I asked you a question. What is your question? I'm watching what's going on in the ring. What is unfair about what the bar did with the big show? An eight-star choke slam. My God. I didn't say it was unfair. I said the time. I'm talking about the timing. That the timing oh, is suspect. On. You've taken on the new day before. You couldn't beat him. Now you go out and recruit the big show and all. Oh, Boom, there you go, new tag team champions. Wow, that was probably the worst argument you've ever had. Oh my God. I'm not even justify go, it. Going for another one. And Big E, and Xavier Rhodes coming here. The official's going to throw out this match. And now Big E comes Why? Why the fuck did you throw it out? They could have literally knocked each other out, for God's sake. The numbers game. This is something the New Day have been doing to their opponents for years, and they're being beaten. Oh the damn! That game. sucks, all tonight. That sucks, man. Oh my god! The size of Big Show next to Big E, and a choke slam to the muscle of the New Day. I guess this is the bar's way of Thanks, making Sam. an emphatic statement of dominance. Don't worry, worry this T-shirt will have a meaning on Twitch as well when we play Siren Hill soon. No, not once! No! What? I love to, Xavier! Good luck stopping this trio. You're gonna be okay, Byron. This isn't a Disney movie. The animated heroes don't always win. New Day will have their opportunity at the SmackDown Tag Team Titles against this version of the ball. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Enough, enough. Oh, no, Big Show, Big Show, stop this. Once catches a you choke slam. You proved your point. Unlike the new tag champs over on Monday Night Raw, these guys actually get along. The bar has changed the game. They defend against the New Day at Crown Jewel. That very same night at Crown Jewel, we will see the WWE World Cup to determine who is the best in the world, featuring the legend Rey Mysterio, who returned last week after nearly five years away from WWE. Um, Mysterio is on oh, nice, Miss TV. Uh, we had Big Show versus Kofi Kingston. During the match, all the bar and the other members of the New Day came in, so they threw out the match. And then the bar and Big Show just destroyed all of them. And then Big Show did a knockout punch and then a choke slam to Jamie Woods. I can't believe it. That everything sticks to Stefan Dick's hands? No, I can't believe how easy it was to save hundreds of dollars on the car insurance of Geico. Cool, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I'd say it's much of a pepper is off now, mate. Believe it, Geico could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Nothing means more to me than this game. I wish things were different. But it won't us to change. I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. Do as you're damn told. Oh, Red Dead, kind of way. God, can't wait for some content on that. Get the PS4 Pro bundle. Sam, who's using your uh, awesome Sam account? Because it was online yesterday. Okay. What happens to those people you take in that church? They have been given a purpose. Overlord, Rated R. 
November 9th. I'm all about my bed. This mattress is dangerously comfortable. When I get in, I literally say, ah. Meet the Lisa mattress. A better place to sleep. This bed hugs my body. I'm now a morning person. The Lisa mattress is designed to provide strong support, relieve pressure, and optimize airflow to keep you cool. Hello, bed of my dreams. Order online. We'll build it, box it, and ship it to your door for you to enjoy. Sleep on it for up to 100 nights and love it, or you'll get a full refund. Returns are free and easy. I love my Lisa. Today is gonna be great. Read our reviews, then try the Lisa mattress in your own home. Order during our fall mattress sale and save. For a limited time, get $150 off and free shipping, too. Sale prices are available right now. Go to buylisa.com today. You need this bed. It's a little personal tonight. There are some things that you can only learn through experience. No, it's my... comes from courage. I can't let my friends die for nothing. You need to run. Nikki's single and all in to mingle. Wait, what? You have something on your face. Am I making you embarrassed because you're with an older woman? I have heard so much about what everyone else thinks, but this is me. Total Divas, brand new tomorrow night at 9 and catch up on demand. We're back here on SmackDown Live inside the Rock, the Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. And one of the biggest stories right now in all the mm. story that has transcended sports, it has transcended entertainment. We want to take a moment to discuss what happened last night on Monday Night Raw. It was the former Universal Champion Roman Reigns who kicked off Raw. Who? John Cena and Nikki Bella? No, mate. They broke up. For months, maybe even a full year, I've come out here and spoke as Roman Reigns, and I said a lot of things, you know. I said that I'd be here every single week. I said I'd be a fighting champion. I said I was going to be consistent, and I said I was going to be a workhorse, but that's all lies. Now, nah, mate, they broke up. Well, there's speculation whether they are broken up or not broken up at this point. We don't know. My real name is Joe. And I've been living with leukemia for 11 years. Fucking and hell, let's be back. back. And because the leukemia is back, I cannot fulfill my role. I can't be that fighting champion. And I'm going to have to relinquish the Universal Championship. When I was 22 years old, I was diagnosed with this. And very quickly, I was able to put it in reverse. Well, seeing the fact they were seen around Australia going through a shopping centre, the bro, there's a lot of speculation they aren't still going out. But everything that's happened that on Total Divas and Total Ballads is all to do with ratings and TV shows. They put me in front of all of you, the WWE Universe, and to be honest, y'all have made my dreams come true. And for that, I have to say thank you so much. Y'all know how life is. Life is not fair. But I want to make one thing clear. By no means is this a retirement speech. Because I have faith. Because after I'm done whooping leukemia's ass once again, I'm coming back home. I'm coming back because I want to show all of you, the whole world, I want to show my family, my friends, my children, and my wife that when life throws a curveball at me, I am the type of man that will stand in that batter's box. I will crowd the plate, I will choke up, and I will swing for the fences every single time. Because I will beat this, and I will be back, so you will see me very, very soon. 
this Thank you so much. God bless you and I love you. may have been one of the saddest moments in recent memory, but that was still one hell of a fucking promo from Roman. That is the true man behind the character. That is what he is like. He is such an inspirational man. He will kick his ass. He will be back. It is a story that has grabbed headlines around the world. It is something the entire world is talking about it. What Roman Reigns did last night, he showed a tremendous content of character. It was unparalleled courage as he now goes into his battle with leukemia. Yeah, it speaks to the incredible strength of Roman and also the incredible resolve to beat leukemia and, of course, come back home here to WWE. Well, it was 24 hours ago the announcement shocked the entire WWE Universe to its very core. But in the hours since, I think a lot of us have had a chance to reflect put a lot of things into perspective and actually been yeah, by Roman Reigns and Roman you know the entire world is behind you I said it last night I still believe it we all do you got this Zeus. we love you we send our very best out to Roman Reigns that's because people respect and the, the man was left Joe and the why Stephanie McMahon acting general manager there told us what to do with the Universal Championship the question now is who will win the vacant Universal Championship come crown jewel the decision is that it will be Braun Strowman who goes one on one with the beast Brock Lesnar for the Universal Championship Oh, I hated the Roman Reigns character. I really did, Ross. I still hate the Roman Reigns character. I could just never hate the man behind the character. I will never deny that Roman Reigns was one hell of a worker and one hell of a talent. I just didn't like his character. Didn't like his moveset. Didn't like anything about Roman Reigns. I still don't really like Roman Reigns. But the man, Joanna Y, I have all the respect for in the world. I will never hate the people behind these characters. Fair enough. People like Roman, people hate Roman. I only happen to really like him when he's in the shield. But... Yeah, pretty much right. Pretty much rocks. Pretty much right. It's like, it's like uh, Michael Cole said, wrestling really isn't a different. Is to really in an alternate reality to our own, and then sometimes this reality seeps into that reality. Yeah, I'm very interested for Miss TV. Can't wait to see what um, Stereo is going to say. More cheese on the line. Game plan. It's another when you're standing across the ring from one of the most elite tag teams to ever step in the ring in the Usos. Not to mention who are probably going to be a little extra motivated tonight, considering what their cousin Roman Reigns went through last night. Think of what happened when it came to Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose last night. They captured the Raw Tag Team titles for Roman Reigns. If the Usos can use the same sort of motivation, they could be unstoppable. So Daniel Bryan going to start this off here against Jimmy Uso. And the question is that Daniel Bryan continues to claim that he has all the respect in the world for AJ Styles. He's been dying to come back to WWE because his dream from the second he thought about coming back was to capture the WWE Championship. Oh. And now that Daniel Bryan has that opportunity within arm's reach, he's going to do whatever it takes to knock off AJ Styles. Any way to pick up an advantage. Oh. 
Jason over the top, but I don't know if Daniel saw the tag, but AJ Styles coming in to help out his partner. Wait a minute, this. Right, it's Styles. Challenger working in unison. Blanche is in stereo. Styles and Brian are rolling, and SmackDown Live continues. The comfortable, the familiar. Neither one of these will ever give you a new perspective on things or make your heart skip a beat. Comfortable isn't something you'll tell your grandkids about. And familiar? Well, that'll be there when you get home. But until then, there's a world that needs exploring. Getting out of your comfort zone. It's possible in the family of Hyundai SUVs. You see, Brad, songs are really about big life moments. Baby shower here. Big life moments. What is in here? Ooh, I hope it's a life insurance policy. What? It's a sensible gift. Protection for you and your family. Nationwide has all the tools to help you find the right coverage. Tiny baby shoes. So close. Makes no sense. Baby can't even walk. Should have been a life insurance policy. Plus, would have been a great song. Think about it. The lyrics, the beneficiaries. Ooh. Brad, where are you going? We have to do it. New content first on PS4. That WWE title is mine! Sound Slammers brawl in the destruction zone! The figures bring the sound, the ring amps it up! The Miz takes over! He's cranking up the power lift! But John Cena hammers in! What time is now? Figures and ring sold separate, batteries not included, adults assemble! Hey, Metro PCS is now Metro by T-Mobile. What? Now you get unlimited high-speed data all month long. I'm switching. Well, that's smart. I'm also taking that bridge. The smarter way to get unlimited. Metro by T-Mobile. That's genius. Hey, kiddo. I'm good. Out there? Not really. Grab your jacket. And try Oreo chocolate candy bars. Disney and Pixar. He loves like bad guys. He's a bad guy. Jack Jack is back. Jack Jack has power? Yeah, baby! Buy Incredibles 2 today and watch it instantly. When you order Domino's, use Domino's new dinner bell to be the pizza night hero that brings them home. When it rings on their devices, they'll come running for their mix and match favorites. Choose any two or more for $5.99 each. What does it take to work at CarMax? That's a great question. If you'd stop in a monsoon to help someone change a tire, save a whale that had beached itself. You're gonna be okay, big guy. Come on! Lend a hand in an old-timey barn raising. Come on, it's jumping on it! And if the middle school dance group was down one member and you'd step in and lead them all the way to glory, then CarMax is for you. Because helping people is what our people are all about. The devil's out there. This Halloween weekend. <laughs> We're giving you the creeps, freaks, and clowns. The NCIS Law and Order SVU Scarathon, a two-day event. You okay? Starts Saturday at 9 a.m. with NCIS. And the scares keep coming this Halloween with The Purge. Tuesday at 10 on USA. And the Usos hammering away on Daniel Bryan in the corner as we welcome you back to SmackDown Live. Thus far, Daniel Bryan and the WWE Champion AJ Styles have worked well together, but Daniel Bryan's in a world of trouble. The Usos have done what they do best, cut the ring in half, isolate their opponent from their corner, and do the work themselves. Jay Uso, oh, isolating the back. Off of the so everyone, don't forget, um, when I hit 100 followers, one random person will be getting a subscription to this channel. The Usos, after last week, uh, were able to capitalize on uh, what appeared to be a miscommunication, incidental contact between Daniel Bryan and AJ Styles. They can knock off this all-star type of team again. What it would do for their careers. Meanwhile, Styles and Daniel Bryan. What do you mean what it would do for their careers? I'm talking about the Usos, Phillips. They're one of the greatest tag teams to ever step in a ring. You're telling me it wouldn't be a marquee victory for them to get ahead in the SmackDown tag team division? Now, Rockus, we saw it was earlier on tonight. 
The Usos did it last week. They they beat Daniel Bryan and the, the reigning WWE champion AJ. Oh my good lord! Collision center of the ring. Jimmy Uso and Daniel Bryan had the same idea. Now can Daniel Bryan use this opportunity to try and make a tag? And Jimmy Uso, legal here against Daniel Bryan, trying to prevent Daniel from getting to the corner. Tag made to the WWE Champion. Jey Uso also tagged in legal for his team. Oh! AJ Styles has teamed well with the man he will defend the WWE title against at Crown Jewel. A one-man wrecking crew right now against the Usos. I was trying to shift the momentum in this match and successfully doing so. Knee to the back of the neck. Here's the cover. Hook to the leg and a kick out. AJ Styles looked stunned. That wasn't enough to keep Jey Uso down, but the WWE Champion's going to have to think up something else if he wants to escape with a victory. Well, I'm sure Styles knows exactly what the Usos are capable of. And talk about thinking up something else. Thinking about the Styles clash here. Well, now trying to turn it around. Jey Uso could not get oh, a hold of oh, 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 Wait a minute. Calf Crusher center of the ring. Jey Uso's in a great deal of jeopardy. And Jimmy Uso saving his brother. Well, here goes Brian. Now Daniel Bryan and Jimmy Uso throwing hands. Oh, and a shot right to the midsection. Now, Daniel Bryan able to get out of dodge and set to the outside. There goes Jimmy. Look at Styles in the back. Styles is poised and ready to strike. Think about the phenomenal form here going up top. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, wait a minute. It's Daniel. Oh, the call with a Pele kick. Again, incidental contact. Oh, come on, Phillips. How naive can you be? Styles was looking for revenge. Splash. Cover. And the Usos have beaten Styles and Bryan again. Here are your winners, the Usos. It was an eye for an eye. AJ Styles was simply waiting for his opportunity to find redemption on Daniel Bryan for last week. I, I get it's the second week in a row, Corey, but that, that's still a hard one to call. Let's take a look at it again. Went for the phenomenal form, was able to stop himself. Again, wasn't going after Daniel Bryan. Jey Uso was tied up there. Yeah. Hit with a Pele kick instead was Daniel Bryan. AJ Styles clearly looked over his shoulder. He saw it for Daniel Bryan standing right there. You don't kick with that sort of accuracy you by are really reaching. Yeah. But guys, it, uh, after two weeks of this now, as the tension mounted to a breaking point, is this no longer a relationship between two men who respect each other? It's not about respect. Respect doesn't win you championships. You have to be successful. You have to know your opponent better than they know themselves. Styles is a reigning champion. Daniel Bryan's a former world champion. They both know what it takes. There was nothing accidental about it. At the very least, they no longer have to worry about beating tag team partners. Daniel Bryan, AJ Styles now focus on each other in their impending championship matchup. That comes up at Crown Jewel, but the focus this week of the WWE Universe is coming up this Sunday, the first ever all-women's pay-per-view event known as Evolution Streaming Live on the WWE Network. And on the raw side, Ronda Rousey defends her women's championship against Nikki Bella. This is a rivalry that began with betrayal. streaming live on the WWE Network. If you haven't done so already, head to wwenetwork.com to sign up because Evolution is free for new subscribers. Go ahead and 
for our last woman standing match for the SmackDown Live Women's Championship at Evolution. Charlotte Flair recently visited the Performance Center down the land of the problem is Becky Lynch showed up too and all hell broke loose. We'll show you what happened next. of all time. Shania Twain! He's a true country legend. Travis Tritt! And he's a platinum selling singer-songwriter. Jake Owen! They've got what it takes to find the next generation of country music superstars. <laughs> Hello. Help from some of the biggest names I'm back. Country music, including oh. Big Rich, Kane Brown, Wynonna, and more. Uh, oh. Chat. Oh, on chat. What about a mod? Uh, I don't know about a mod after now. I'll figure out that after a while. Sorry, I, uh, needed to take care of some other stuff. Deductible? Definitely speaking insurance. Additional interest on umbrella policy? Can you translate? Damage minimization of civil commotion. When insurance needs translating, get answers in plain English at progressiveanswers.com. He wants you to sign Karen's birthday card. It's a high honor. <laughs> Like leather, skin is stronger when it's hydrated, but 9 out of 10 men don't get the hydration their skin needs. That's why Dove Men Plus Care Body Wash has a unique hydrating formula to keep men's skin healthier and stronger. How did Arby's finally make the turkey sandwich exciting? We deep fried it. Just the turkey part, not the whole sandwich. For now. Arby's, we have the meat for sandwiches. What's up, mate? You seem to have stopped chatting the second I come back. But it's never too late to feel Christmas joy. That's not gonna happen. The Grinch, really PG. Merry Christmas, D. Get in the ring. High flying off the ropes insanity. Roman reigns with the spear. Kinshasa. It's multi man mayhem. Awesome. Dad, isn't my turn yet? It's only been 10 minutes. It's been four hours. WWE figures rings championship titles and masks each sold separately. The king is going crazy. Making 10 nuggets just a dollar. Crazy, right? Crazy crispy. Crazy juicy. 10 nuggets made of crazy delicious white meat for just a dollar. Now that's a crazy deal. Enjoy 10 golden nuggets for just a dollar. Only at Burger King. The WWE Universe all agrees. Breast cancer is unacceptable. And we won't stand for it. And so we race. We fundraise. Hello, we awesome. Hello, mate. We even scream it from the mountaintop. We come together and many ways. And together, we have raised over $2 million to put an end to breast cancer. 
Join our fight, save lives, because there is no we without you. Excuse me, AJ? AJ, I just have to ask, was what just happened between you and Daniel an accident, or was it intentional? It certainly appeared to be very similar to what Daniel did to you last week. Hold on a second. Of course it was an accident. Just like last week was an accident, right, Daniel? Yeah. I mean, I have an infinite amount of respect for AJ, so mine was for sure an accident. Well, hold on a second. You, you think I would sacrifice... Are you calling me a liar? No, it's no, 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 not at all. Yeah, Tom, but did they, did they hit you in the face? I don't, I, it looks like your nose might be growing. What are you talking about? My nose growing. Yeah. yeah. Wait, wait. Are you, are you referring to Pinocchio? What are you What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What's no, I, that? I mean, I'm just convinced that it, it was an accident. I'm sure. It was an accident. Uh, yeah, I'm sure it was. 100. percent Yeah. What What is this? What are you doing with your hand? What is that? This. I thought this was how you do it, brother. Yeah, that's how you do it. Dang. Too sweet, brother, right? Hard to tell what was and what was not an accident, no, but it's not. the tensions continue to build between AJ Styles and Daniel Bryan. WWE title match coming up at Crown Jewel. But again, as we've talked about throughout the night, this Sunday, it is WWE Evolution. We will feature a last woman standing match, the first ever last woman standing match for the SmackDown Women's Championship. We're going to hear from Charlotte Flair in a matter of moments. But first, we want to take you back to an altercation that happened this past Saturday at the WWE Performance Center in Orlando. Hey, yeah, welcome back, Sam. How are you? Thank you guys so much for coming in on your off day. I know you guys are working extremely hard, but I'm honored to speak to all of you and share my journey. I remember just six years ago, I was scared of my own shadow. Literally, I would step inside that ring and I would like shake and Norman would be like, are you okay? I'm like, yes, I'm, I'm gonna make it. So just remember to push yourself to your limits because you never know where you're gonna end up. I never thought I was gonna be here. So when I got to NXT, I utilized the facility, I utilized my coaches, and uh, sorry, I leaned on my peers. This business is built on respect. Respect yourself, respect others, don't let anyone walk all over you, but don't ever look down on someone because you never know when you're gonna need that hand. <laughs> now ladies, WWE Evolution is this Sunday. Um, I, I'm not gonna cry because I do that all the time, but I feel that as if evolution happened because of what we built here in these very rings. Now I'm standing in front of you guys and I can't wait to see what you guys built off of that. You guys are the present and the future and I am honored to be standing in front of all of you and I hope I get to face every single one of you eventually. Um, so thank you for letting me come down here. Uh, Ross is here. Guys. Just uh, observe, not trying on any of you. Any questions? Um, I have a question. Um, so what are the major differences in competing from NXT to Raw and now SmackDown? I think the biggest difference is just reintroducing your character to a new audience globally. And here you guys have the opportunity to practice every day once you're on the main roster. It's a little harder to get in those practice sessions unless you come early because it's a different city every single night all over the world. But you'll be ready, I promise. <laughs> you can just stare there. <laughs> I have a question. Yes. How do you feel about being in your first ever last woman standing match? I'm honored and... I have a question. I have a question. Uh, who invited you here? People should be listening to the real chant. All right? You want some advice? You want some advice for the actual chant? Yeah? Yeah, don't listen to a word she's saying because none of you are going to make it if you do. Don't make it. Becky, this is not nothing no, to do no. with them. No, they need to hear the advice from the chant. Don't make friends with anybody. Yeah, they'll hold you back and they'll blindside you as soon as they get the chance. You gotta do what I'm doing. You gotta strike them before they strike you. You want an education of a lifetime, yeah? 
Watch evolution, watch what I do to her. Study it, take notes, be in awe. Because no amount of training or privilege or self-righteousness is going to prepare you for what I'm about to do to you. Becky, that's enough. Coach, let her talk. Coach, let her talk. Kick her ass! I fucking love Becky! Becky, after all of the attacks, after all of the insults, what you did at the performance center was unforgivable. You disrespected Oh, fuck the off, Charlotte! You're not the fucking baby face no here! fight proved that this isn't just about titles or friendships. No, you changed. And there's no going back because there's no line that you won't cross. At WWE Evolution, when I oh my God, Charlotte, I nobody fucking cares. You've attacked her as much as she's attacked you for fuck's sake. Don't try and act all sympathetic now because she I'll kicked your fucking ass. Lost her way. So it comes down to this for the first time ever, a last woman standing match. For the SmackDown Live Women's Championship, Becky Lynch defends against Charlotte Fair. No pinfalls, no pass, no disqualification. Anything goes at stake is the opportunity to stand proudly over your broken and humiliated former best friend to vanquish and dethrone her once and for all. Will it be Lynch? Will it be Flair? We'll find out this Sunday. First woman in incapacitate her opponent so they cannot answer a referee's count of ten. We'll be the one of the winner. Yeah, I know so. Yeah, any interact and actually sh react when it's something interesting like the Roman stuff like uh, heartbreaking and half the time it's nothing ready to react to but yeah that I'm passionate about the Becky and Charles Oh, thank you, Sam. Tonight on the Mixed Match Challenge, after we defeat Team Paws, we will be one step closer to winning the Mixed Match Challenge. Hey, hey, welcome back, Javier. WWE Mixed Match Challenge. Tonight, streaming live on Facebook. How are you doing today? Wish you were here to see how bright the human spirit can shine. To see that no matter what nature does, people will do more. With one of the industry's largest catastrophe response teams, State Farm will always be among the first to arrive and the last to leave. To help show that human nature is greater than nature, State Farm, here to help recovery go right. The king is going crazy, making 10 nuggets just a dollar. Crazy, right? Crazy crispy, crazy juicy. 10 nuggets made of crazy delicious white meat for just a dollar. Now that's a crazy deal. Enjoy 10 golden nuggets for just a dollar. Only at Burger King. Package for James Miser. Once you start smoking, the consequences will find you. Cigarettes may leave you with stained teeth, gum disease, and more. Oh, thank you, Sam. V. Great, mate. Give extra, get extra. Boom! 
<laughs> nice, I'll be back anyway, mate. Your face. All good. Have a break. Mm. Breaks are good. Have one. Like leather, skin is stronger when it's hydrated. But nine out of ten men don't get the hydration their skin needs. That's why Dove Men Plus Care Body Wash has a unique hydrating formula to keep men's skin healthier and stronger. Mm. Returns this November. Smackdown Live and a enraged Rusev is ready to, to lay retaliation on man he once called his friend. Rusev, I turned your World Cup dreams into dust. And now no, I destroy nice. you in this city of dirt and rust. <laughs> Lana, watch, you know I'm right. Instead of a short Rusev day, you could have had a hot, long, Aiden Knight. Yeah, I'm living. Well, what is wrong with Aiden? As if Rusev's not already oh. doing it. And now Rusev is going Aiden just running like a little chicken. Here comes Rusev. Oh, Alana blocks it. And a massive punch to Aiden English. My God. And into the barrier. Rusev is destroying the man. That enough reaction for you. And a lovely fist bump from Lana. Oh! Aiden takes advantage of going to get in the ring and massive. No. Classic case of jealousy. This Aiden English, he truly believes. Well, maybe you're good, so who knows? Gonna start this again. This is your spot. This is all your spot. Ooh, massive mask kick. Thank you, Sam. Is he gonna go for the accolade? I think it's time for the accolade. Here we go. And is aiming this gonna tap. And he taps, but Rusev isn't letting go. Here comes Lana. He finally lets go. Rusev gets a measure of justice with his beautiful wife Lana at hand. English is trying to escape. Let it go, Rusev. Let it go. Ooh, I'm intrigued now. Oh, what is that? Oh. Man, I'm going to lose some buttons. Yes, from Miss TV next. Come on, wait.
Streaming Cannot wait. I've got a free wrestling show tomorrow. Going crazy. Making 10 nuggets just a dollar? Crazy, right? Crazy crispy. Crazy juice. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Crazy delicious white meat for just a dollar. Now that's a crazy deal. Enjoy 10 golden nuggets for just a dollar. Only at Burger King. Rude like a chicken. Anything for the irresistible when did I say rude and like a chicken? What are you doing? Temptation. Okay. Cats can't resist. Get in the ring. High flying off the ropes insanity. Roman reigns with the spear. Kinshasa. It's multi man mayhem. Awesome. Dad, isn't my turn yet? It's only been 10 minutes. It's been four hours. Life's well, okay, man. How's your life going? Let's face it. The world could use some more. Mm. How does Dove Men Plus Care anti burst protect you differently? This is soothing. It's comfortable. Dove goes on smoothly. You don't have to worry about drying out your skin. Try Dove Men Plus Care, the only anti burst with 48 hour sweat protection and Dove's one quarter moisturizer technology. Tough on sweat, not on skin. We saved hundreds on our car insurance when we switched to Geico. This is how it made me feel. It was like that feeling when you're mowing the lawn on a sunny day and without even trying, you end up with one last strip that's exactly the width of your mower. When you're done, it looks so good, you post a picture on social media. And it gets 127 likes. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Charmin Ultra Soft. Softer than ever. Charmin Ultra Soft is softer than ever, so it's harder to resist. Okay, this is getting a little weird. Enjoy the go with Charmin. Amanda Green, with this contract, I relinquish part of my freedom. <coughs> Fair enough. There's a contract in every cigarette. When you light up, you sign up. Don't let tobacco control you. Some restaurants say you should drink your meals. Well, America deserves better. At Hardee's and Carl's Jr., choose from a variety of full-flavored all-star meals starting at five bucks. Get a real meal. Paid for by Hardee's and Carl's Jr. This mattress is dangerously comfortable. When I get in, I literally say, ah. Meet the Lisa mattress. A better place to sleep. This bed hugs my body. I'm now a morning person. The Lisa mattress is designed to provide strong support, relieve pressure, and optimize airflow to keep you cool. Hello, bed of my dreams. Order online. We'll build it, box it, and ship it to your door for you to enjoy. Sleep on it for up to 100 nights and love it, or you'll get a full refund. Returns are free and easy. I love my Lisa. Today is gonna be great. Find out why so many people love the Lisa mattress. Then try it in your own home or at any West Elm store. Order during our fall mattress sale and save. For a limited time, get $150 off and free shipping too. Sale prices are available right now. Go to buylisa.com today. You need this bed. Let's all try not to die. You want it, you got it. Welcome to the most must-see WWE talk show in history. Welcome to... Ms. T. Oh, One week ago, the entire world celebrated SmackDown 1000. And some of the greatest sports entertainment memories in recent memory. <laughs> I mean, who could forget Becky Lynch cutting down Edge on his own show? How about Evolution reuniting for the first time on SmackDown Live? 
and most importantly, my defeat of Rusev in record time to qualify for the WWE World Cup Tournament to determine the best in the world. And no... I'll oh, see you later, Sam. Thanks for joining me. No one can forget a future Hall of Famer returning in grand fashion. He defeated the United States champion Shinsuke Nakamura. Fair enough. Rey Mysterio. Wow. I'm gonna have a nice cheap fucking insurance next year. I see like oh Ten by ten. Gentlemen, Ray Mysterio. As you can see, the WWE Universe is thrilled to have you back. But as the host of, of Ms. TV, I can't help but be a bit curious as to why you are back. Well, first, let me say that it feels so good to be back home. Oh. But the reason why I'm back is... See, that wasn't a question. See, I know why you're back. You're out to show the world that the little man can achieve big things. That the little engine can climb up that hill. And if you... If you, if you wish big enough, and you try hard enough, then all dreams can come true. I'm going to crown Joel. You're an asshole. How very 90s of you. You see, You've been gone for a little while. People are no longer interested in the plucky underdog anymore. They are interested in larger than life stars like me. Wow, yes, yeah, so they're looking at me. I will repeat that. They are interested in larger than life stars like me. How do know? See, while you've been on hiatus, I have been here, becoming the most must-see WWE superstar of all time. I've been the big man, the middle man, and I've been little men just like you. I am the star of this show. I am the star of this network. I am the star of everything. I am the multi-talent of the WWE. I do it all. And in 10 days at Crown Jewel, I will advance out of that SmackDown bracket, and I will move on to the finals 
and I will take on whoever it is, whatever superstar Raw has, and I will beat them, and then I will prove and confirm to you and to everyone here what I already know, that I am the best in the world. Are you trying to know what I'm talking insane. Best in the world. So, Ray, I am so sorry to disappoint. You're absolutely right. I am very disappointed. Because I thought I was booked to be on Truth TV. <laughs> Truth TV. What is, yeah. You, uh, uh, what is, it, is that a joke? Is it, do you want a dance break? <laughs> oh, you're full of jokes. You know what? Truth, Truth was full of jokes too. And then I beat him and had that show canceled. What happened last week was an illegal broadcast and I'm taking legal action. And if you don't watch yourself, I will cancel your appearance right here, right now. Okay, take it easy now. Let me do you the favor and save you the trouble because I didn't come back to SmackDown Live to be on some dusty talk show. I actually came back to compete. So, if you have nothing else to say, Orale, se cállate la boca. And let's throw down right now. There we go, just talking. Ray, I can assure you that no one here wants us to fight. Well, I want you to fight. It's just, it's, it's just not gonna happen. Nobody really wants. I'm not gonna, guys, you don't understand. I am a changed person. I would never do something. Oh, oh man, I got a mess going on to Ray Mysterio. Yeah, yeah, Miz was simply defending himself from the threat of Ray Mysterio. Ray simply made a challenge to the Miz wants to compete here on SmackDown Live. Ray said, Kaya Te La Boca. You know what that means? I don't either. But oh, 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 wait a minute. It means Miz should wait stop talking. Wait a minute. Stop. Here we go! It was six on nine, and Miz is rolling out. Ray's made a challenge. Will Miz accept it? Are we going to have this match next? I, I've got goosebumps being out here. I can't believe it. I've seen you in your prime. I've, I've cheered your victories and your opponents in your era, and I can finally tell you, woman to woman, you sucked. <laughs>
Your insurance rates skyrocket after a scratch so small you could fix it with a pen. How about using that pen to sign up for new insurance instead? For drivers with accidents, they will raise their rates because of their first accident. This is Dr. Gunter Zuloff. Did he solve Carmichael's totient conjecture? Yes. Yes, he did. Or did he buy his car at drive time using the industry's smartest online tools? No. No, he did not. Dr. Gunter Zuloff was almost a genius. Get fast online financing and know your down payment. Shop over 15,000 vehicles at drivetime.com, the genius way to buy a car. Justin. Nothing. What are you doing? Hey. Ray? You still need me. I have a friend in a sensitive situation. I've run across a few fixers in my time. Wait, you're not doing anything crazy, are you? We have a problem. You don't have to do this. Ray! You're not gonna tell anyone what you saw. I'm gonna take care of it. Ray Donovan, new season, only on Showtime. Start your free trial. No job, no family, just walk away. It's my number one fantasy. Number one fantasy pick, Don. Huh? David Johnson. David Johnson, good. Great. Snickers satisfies. How does Dove Men Plus Care Antiperspirant protect you differently? This is soothing. It's comfortable. Dove goes on smoothly. You don't have to worry about drying out your skin. Try Dove Men Plus Care, the only antiperspirant with 48 hour sweat protection and Dove's one quarter moisturizer technology. Tough on sweat, not on skin. Liberty Mutual Accident Forgiveness means they won't hike your rates over one mistake. See? Liberty Mutual doesn't hold grudges. For drivers with accident forgiveness, Liberty Mutual won't raise their rates because of their first accident. Liberty, 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 Liberty. SmackDown Live, this match made official during the break by our general manager, Paige Rey Mysterio, one-on-one -on -one with The Miz. Great call by the general manager. Can I just take a moment to say how much I respect The Miz, willing to accept this matchup on short notice. Miz came accept. out here to host Miz TV. These are two men who are part of the field of eight in the WWE World Cup. Mm. The best in the world at mm. Tool, hashtag WWE World Cup. Rey Mysterio trying to launch himself over the top, and now Miz sent into our desk and a boat right to the chin. Mysterio, full head of steam. Uh oh. Oh. Splash to the you outside of the floor Mysterio. by Mysterio. Mysterio may have been away from WWE for several years, but has not missed a step in phenomenal physical. He literally condition. appeared at the fucking Royal Rumble in 2014. He appeared at the Royal Rumble in 2018. For fuck's sake. Don't forget his Royal Rumble appearance, Miz. 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 Now Mysterio all over the Miz. Six years is not several years. Um, fucking boy wife. An entire one night tournament at Crown Jewel. Listen, you're talking about a guy who has made a career out of defying the odds. Oh, proving doubters incorrect. Rey Mysterio has done it all and then some. There's absolutely no reason he couldn't do it once again. Uh -oh. oh, man. Except for the fact the Miz is also in the tournament. Right into the top turnbuckle, Miz able to sidestep, and Mysterio now is in trouble. Uh, and Graves make an excellent point. Uh, the Miz is a master manipulator, always finds a way to cut corners. Perhaps he could walk out as the best in the world. When you say it like that, it sounds so negative. It's not cutting corners, it's solving problems. In business, he would be promoted for it. Now, this is where Miz turned it around. Watch this. Bam! Went to the top turnbuckle, right to the sternum of Mysterio. Now, the first, uh, Outs of offense, and Miz has gotten for a match he didn't want to be part of. I'm ready, ready. 
And this is actually going to be part of two matches tonight because later on on Mixed Match Challenge on Facebook Watch, immediately following SmackDown Live, he teams up with Asuka against Jimmy Uso and Naomi. Oh, I'd have to check the numbers, but I'm pretty sure The Miz is the single hardest working man in entertainment these days. Oh. Don't. You, you really believe this stuff? Yeah. Oh, that's why I say it. They write to the spine up by Miz and Mrs. The hit reality show has already been renewed for a second season here on USA. Oh, Miz has reminded us a number of times. I was trying to slow down Mysterio. I mean, I got to do Raw and SmackDown and all the pay-per-views, but I don't have a reality show. <laughs> Maybe you will soon. Who knows? I mean, like the top five list, though. <laughs> now Mysterio trying to create separation in uh, Byron. How, how beneficial could this be for Miz trying to soften up Mysterio before Crown Jewel? Oh, well, it's huge. I mean, it's a huge mental momentum builder, and the Miz can somehow knock off oh, Rey Mysterio. Oh, and again into the turnbuckle. Skull crushing finale in round. Trying to set it up. Mysterio, great evasion there. And now Miz trying to slow him down, looking for the ripcord, and now, oh! <laughs> How do you slow down Mysterio? That's what a lot of superstars have failed to accomplish. Say, you can ask thousands of superstars over the years. Let's try this again. Ray Mysterio about to dial it up. Time to make a call. What's the 619 Miz able to escape? How about those invasion hey. skills? DDT up to the leg. Kick out. Mysterio versus Miz rolls on here on SmackDown Live. Janice, Mom told me you bought a house. So now that you have a house, you can use Home Code Explorer. Quiet, I'm blasting my quads. Janice, look. I'm in a meeting. Janice, look. <laughs> look, look. I'm looking. It's easy. You just answer some simple questions online and you get coverage options to choose from. You're ruining my workout. Cycling is my passion. Thank you, Razor. Yep. Up and down, never side to side. Shakim, you got it? Come on, stay focused. All right, baby. Come pay off. Booking a flight at the last minute doesn't have to be expensive. Just go to Priceline. It's the best place to book a flight a few days before my trip and still save up to 40%. Just tap and go. For the best savings on flights, go to Priceline. Save money on your heating bills by filling gaps and cracks with a premium insulating foam sealant. Loctite Type Foam with four times more density. It provides better insulation and durability. Save money with Loctite Type Foam. Dude, Pop-Tart splits already fuse two Pop-Tarts together. See? Strawberry and cheesecake. Yeah, but watch me fuse four Pop-Tarts together. With this. Save the Pop-Tarts! Dude, my mom's gonna kill me! Here on SmackDown Live, Rey Mysterio one on one with the Miz, and we are end. about to be treated to the world famous It Kicks, made famous by the Miz, despite all other imposters. These were stolen from Daniel Bryan, who we saw in competition earlier tonight. In fact, Newark, New Jersey just called them the No Kicks. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, couldn't take a care of Rey Mysterio. Mm. In the boat. Didn't get all of it. Mysterio in trouble, able to kick out. Well, it's, it's illegal to make a left turn in this state. I don't exactly trust their opinion on anything. Take a look back. This is during the commercial break. Boom! Rey Mysterio caught up his own momentum, sent him out of the ring, and Miz just guided him through. Yeah, Miz just stalking Mysterio. Come on, Mysterio. Oh, and again, the turnbuckles. That is where Miz has really made a living here in this matchup. Just smashing Rey Mysterio into the turnbuckle and over and over. Remember these two, part of the field of eight for the WWE World Cup to determine the best in the world at Crown Jewel. Oh, if this no lands, way. no way. Mysterio's not going to make it to Crown Jewel. Wait a minute. Looking for the skull-crushing finale here all the way from the top of the turnbuckles. Mysterio fighting it. Oh! What a counter. You're at a star-studded field, Phillips. You're talking about Seth Rollins, Dolph Ziggler, 
John Cena, Kurt Angle from the Monday Night Raw side of things. Plus, you've got Jeff Hardy, Randy Orton, Rey Mysterio, and The Miz. Randy Orton and Jeff Hardy go one on one later on tonight. I mean, that field you have to beat in one night is unbelievable. Cena sent on here from Rey Mysterio, trying to pick up the pace against The Miz. Oh, wait a minute, Mysterio. Oh, get out of here. Man, right to the side of the face. This might be out. You don't generally crawl on your hands and knees when you're out, Saxton. <laughs> oh, and a shot right to the midsection. Oh, the massive kick to the face. The security side of the face. Oh, the top. oh caught. Pick down midair. Caught up by Miz. Backbreaker. Miz, can he put away Mysterio? And another kick out. With incredible resiliency is something Rey Mysterio has used as a hallmark throughout his career. You're yeah. absolutely right, Byron. But for as much punishment as Rey Mysterio can take, Miz has had no problem dishing out more and more and digging deeper into his arsenal. Now Miz dodge. He's there. Oh, caught down by the Miz. Runs down Mysterio. Hook to the leg here. Mysterio kicks out again. Starting to lose it a little bit here. This is understandably oh. frustrated. Saxon, he wasn't as, he wasn't expecting to compete until later tonight at Mixed Match Challenge alongside Oscar. Now he's in there with one of the greatest of all time, Rey Mysterio. Think about the skull crushing finale yet again. Mysterio able to counter. Like, oh wait a minute! Thought about an Alabama slam. It's oh, six one nine. Oh. I ran the game for a second. Ray. Two-time SmackDown Women's Champion Naomi set for tag team action here with her newfound friend. Saxon, if she weren't married, Naomi would be the perfect woman for you. She comes with her own nightlife. That's cute. Real cute. <laughs> Naomi's going to team up with her husband, Jimmy Uso, later tonight. Actually against Asuka on Mixed Match Talent, who's with Miz on Facebook Watch. who come Sunday, Sunday will be involved in a battle royal for a future women's title opportunity at Evolution. They team up tonight. They will have to put the friendship aside come Sunday. Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville await as Naomi and Oscar 
Ask are set for tag team action. Next, here on SmackDown Live. Andy Rose, how's my hair look? Microwave doesn't need another frozen meal, and neither do you. Only Carl's Jr. and Hardy's bring the heat with a variety of full-flavored all-star meals starting at five bucks. What? Get a real meal paid for by Carl's Jr. and Hardy's. Once you start smoking, the consequences will find you. Package for James Miser. Oh. Seems so loud. Cigarettes may leave you with stained teeth, gum disease, and more. I don't know why I just said they were not flying. Dubman Plus Care Stain Defense go beyond sweat protection. Please. Doesn't stain my clothes. I don't get the uh, underarm pit stains. We couldn't have said it better ourselves. Try Dubman Plus Care Stain Defense for anti stain and anti mark protection. So, State Farm will be here to help protect our home? Of course. What about here? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Eh. Okay. Oh, Go with the one that's here to help life go right. State Farm. Yeah, Kevin, you have to lie on. He's here to help you stay on track. Budget's looking good. Clear for a fill up. Bart, thank you. We are a go on the beef jerky. You know what? We had some hydration too. Thanks, Chief. USAA Bank helps you take charge of your everyday spending so you can stay a step ahead. Let's rock and roll! Find help at every turn with USAA Bank. <laughs> at Pizza Hut, we're more than just $5 medium one topping pizzas. Whoa, wait, medium pizzas? For $5? And all these sides? Only five bucks? I'm speechless. The new $5 lineup because no one out pizzas the hut. Promote what makes your business great with Vistaprint. Whether it's a business card, a banner, or a postcard, we have the paper stocks, sizes, and design options to create marketing that's right for your business. Give it a try with 500 standard business cards starting at just $9.99 when you use code VP500 at Vistaprint.com. My prescriptions used to be really expensive, but then I went to GoodRx.com. It just works. You put in the drug you're looking for, and bang, you've got half a dozen or more choices in front of you of pricing and locations to get it. You never think about shopping around for medication prices. I have good insurance, but with GoodRx, I save even more money. What? I was paying how much? <laughs> and it's absolutely free. No cost to me whatsoever. I get to save $1,180 a year with GoodRx. This is awesome. Sometimes urging is the only answer. It is my right. This is the deal of a lifetime. What is wrong with you? I'm not afraid. Blessed be America, a nation reborn. WWE Evolution is presented by WWE 2K19, the video game. Being hailed as phenomenal and the best 2K title yet. Available now. And by K Jewelers. For all the moments, for love, forever. Back here on SmackDown Live, set for tag team action. Asuka and Naomi, friends now, they will have to put it aside come Sunday at Evolution.
same can be said for this uh, tandem of Sonya Deville and Phillips. Oh my gosh. And our opponents, the team of Sonya Deville and Mandy Rose. I can say without a shadow of a doubt, there has never been anything this beautiful in the entire state of New Jersey before. We were talking about her last night on Raw, as a matter of fact. She wasn't even on the show. So, the fact is, Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville, along with Phillips, enough. We know about evolution. We know about the battle royal, past, present, future, etc., so on, so forth. Title opportunities. We get it. Mandy Rose is here, Tom. Well, you're a massive broadcaster, aren't you? I'm really good. Oscar and Naomi set to take on Sony to build Mandy Rose Graves. Uh, the thing that's really troubling, I'm sure, for you is that she just looked at me. Oh, no, my. she didn't. Sony and Mandy. Wait. <laughs> oh, no. Saving your friendship. These two. I don't know if I understand this. Billy Kay and Peyton Royce, the Iconics. Must be a production error. It's not the right time for this. I'm going to give you some airflow. They are also involved in the Battle oh, Royale. What's exciting about Newark? Oh, no, 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 no. I was talking about this Sunday at WWE Evolution. Where we will make history by winning the Battle Royal. And it will be iconic. By we, she means I, because only one person can win the Battle Royal. Friendship's going the window. I have never been so happy to see Lana. One more time, Moot Lana is in after earlier tonight when her husband Rusev destroyed it in English. I'll be feeling pretty good going into the Battle Royale. Happy Lana Day! That's what's gonna help. Oh, you ate it. Looks like we got more to play against for trying to steal Rusev's day. You know, guys, there's Carmelo's birthday at you. That doesn't mean you can't interrupt what's happening. Mandy Rose is in the room, okay, though. Yeah, sorry. But nobody here wants to hear anybody talk. What everybody here in Newark, New Jersey wants is bail money. Like, what they really, really, really want is a dance break. Yeah, a dance break. Come on, Corey, sing what your mama gave you. never even got started. All these women are going to be involved in the Battle Royale Sunday at Evolution, and apparently they couldn't wait. There's a little Evolution warm-up here tonight on SmackDown Live. Oh, they only just took care of Carmella. They're actually going to be oh, nice. this Sunday with a championship opportunity on the line. That's the name of the game. Make a name for yourself on a history-making stage. Two Hall of Famers are going to be involved. The ones are Blaze and Ivory. An incredible field. Oh! Don't oh, forget Molly Holly. Oh! I guess when Mandy Rose is around, you can forget Molly Holly, right, Tom? Shut up, Grace. Well, just with a battle royal, uh, Mandy Rose will be gone. Wait a minute. Vega alone. Oh, double A's in the corner to Lana. And uh, Vega thought she was the last one at Stanton. We don't want to turn around, Zelina. Here's Zelina. Grip your teeth. Oh! Oh, my gosh. Vega was not ready for Oscar. Roman is the same. Premier things to come. Could it be Oscar standing tall in the Battle Royale with a future women's title opportunity? Check, go check. Yeah, go check. check. Yeah, okay. I'm just making sure. History is going to be made this Sunday, streaming live on the WWE Network. It is the first all-women's pay-per-view known as WWE Evolution from Long Island, New York, in the Nassau Coliseum. If you haven't done so already, head to WWEnetwork.com to sign up because Evolution is free for new subscribers. The Monday Night Raw side of things, a rivalry that has started as a war of words and has become very personal. Raw Women's Champion Rowdy Ronda Rousey will defend her title against the woman who believes she is solely responsible for the entire women's evolution, Nikki Bella. And it is a <laughs> battle of generations. WWE Hall of Famers and former champions, Trish Stratus and Lita, team together again against one of their long-
longtime rivals Mickey James and her new ally Alexa Bliss live Sunday. And for NXT, the rivalry which began at last year's May Young Classic continues. Current NXT champion Kyrie Sane meets the brutal submission specialist Shayna Baszler for the NXT Women's Championship. From Monday Night Raw, the Riot Squad has been called in chaos and mayhem for anyone in their path. Will Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Natalya hope to stop their momentum at WWE Evolution? And we just saw a preview in Women of the Past, Present and Future will meet in the Ultimate Battle Royal with the ultimate prize on the line, a future championship opportunity. You're only eliminated when you're tossed over the top rope and both feet hit the floor. And for the first time ever, a last woman standing match. From SmackDown Live, Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair meet in a match where you win by incapacitating your opponent so they cannot answer the count of ten. It's last woman standing. History will be made this Sunday live from the Nassau Coliseum on Long Island. It is the first ever all-women's pay-per-view WWE Evolution streaming live on the WWE Network. If you haven't done so already, head to WWENetwork.com to sign up because Evolution is free for new subscribers. Looking forward to Evolution, but we can't forget about what's still to come tonight. We have seen a more vicious Randy Orton in recent months than ever before, and the Viper is in action tonight. Another remarkable accomplishment in his impeccable 16-year career could be a winning Randy Orton at Crown Jewel, but first, he has to go through one of the competitors in the prestigious one-night tournament. Rivals go at it. Orton versus Jeff Hardy is next. to another Halloween without getting eaten. And this year was a close one. Yeah, tell me about it. Ooh, you feel that chill? I don't feel anything. Oh, <laughs> uh, this can't be good. Hello, Michael. Get inside! Run! Oh! You don't believe in the boogeyman? You should. I kind of wait to see that one. The story of a pair of lungs that smoked as a teen and never grew to normal size. Hey, little lungs. Want to snowboard with us? Sounds great. Count me in. Woohoo! I'm ready. Yeah! <laughs> Speed up! My little lungs can't get enough air. Smoking as a teen can stunt your lungs, keeping them little forever. Oh, poor little lungs. In a great big world. <sighs> Where are mom and dad? Save money on motorcycle insurance with Geico going up the country. Well, mom and dad. I'm taking a nap. Dude, you just woke up. This is turkey in a vat of boiling oil. And these are Arby's deep fried turkey sandwiches. What inspired us to serve the tastiest yet most risky preparation of turkey? 
a really confusing motto here at Arby's that we live by. If you love it, fry it. And if you don't love it that much, fry it until you love it. I never noticed that. Arby's, we have the meat for sandwiches. I'm all about my bed. This mattress is dangerously comfortable. When I get in, I literally say, ah. Meet the Lisa mattress. A better place to sleep. This bed hugs my body. I'm now a morning person. The Lisa mattress is designed to provide strong support, relieve pressure, and optimize airflow to keep you cool. Hello, bed of my dreams. Order online. We'll build it, box it, and ship it to your door for you to enjoy. Sleep on it for up to 100 nights and love it, or you'll get a full refund. Returns are free and easy. I love my Lisa. Today is gonna be great. Read our reviews, then try the Lisa mattress in your own home. Order during our fall mattress sale and save. For a limited time, get $150 off and free shipping too. Sale prices are available right now. Go to buylisa.com today. You need this bed. Nikki's single and all in to mingle. Oh, so much about what everyone else thinks, but this is me. Total Divas, brand new tomorrow night at 9, and catch up on demand. Here comes the moment. Here we go. My God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the love, and right back at you. What's up, Newark? You know, there are a lot of firsts happening around WWE right now, including the first ever all-women's pay-per-view called Evolution happening this Sunday. A momentous occasion in WWE history, and for all of the women of the past and present that have made this happen, Congratulations to you all. I can't wait to watch and well deserved. Another first is going to happen at Crown Jewel with the first ever, first ever WWE World Cup will determine who will be known as the best in the world. Think about that for a second. One superstar will have the accolade of knowing that they are the best in the world. But who can that person be? Yeah, I think so. I don't not. believe he's in the tournament. <laughs> He yeah, has your response to the CM Punk well, chat. Personally, there is immense ah. amount of talent competing in WWE. An immense amount of talent competing in WWE's World Cup. Personally, I think that somebody from the blue brand is going to be known as the best in the world. Could it be the Enigma Jeff Hardy? Yes. Could it be the multi-talented both on the microphone and getting it done in the ring? Could it be the Miz? No. 
Could it be a returning WWE superstar that's been on fire from last week qualifying and tonight? Could it be Rey Mysterio? I think the fans love Rey. Or could it be one of the most decorated WWE superstars in history, Randy Orton? We will find out who is truly going to be named best in the world at Crown Jewel. But that's Dan, and this is now. So, Newark, are you ready for your main event? Yes. Let's do it. But frankly, the SmackDown Live side of the WWE World Cup to determine the best of the world very may well get it done at Crown Jewel. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 225 pounds. Yeah, exactly. Drew McIntyre's fantastic. Pension Sky, both on the fantastic. Think about the story if a superstar like a Drew especially is on fire right now. In this tournament, a man who's well, his career, the state of his career called into question that held the show. And guys, with Jeff Hardy looking forward to WWE Crown Jewel, the WWE World Cup to determine who is the best in the world next week. SmackDown Live rolls through Atlanta, guys. I'm curious to see what the fallout is for the first ever all women's pay per view WWE. <laughs> Jeff Hardy has in store for Randy Orton tonight. No shortage of history between these two superstars. Yeah, Finn Balor was Irish. Drew McIntyre was Scottish. Shinsuke is Japan. Ben Mysterio is obviously Mexico. It's Jeff Hardy. Jeff Hardy versus Randy Orton, which I know we've had a few matches with them, but I'm inter interested still. It's been a fantastic year. Gives one of them great um, momentum towards Crown Jewel, which we still don't know what the fuck is going on with Crown Jewel at this point. Yeah. Honestly, it's up in the air with what the hell is going on with personal Crown Jewel. There are some things that you can only learn through experience. Joy comes from courage. I can't let my friends die for nothing. You need to run. Your country is a competition. A search for the next generation of country music superstars. Real Country premieres Tuesday, November 13th at 10 on USA. Little Caesars Large Hot and Ready Pepperoni Pizza is just five bucks, 364 days a year. High five. Yeah. Little Caesars Hot and Ready Classic, only five dollars. Pizza, pizza. If only there was a place nearby you could get one of these. Or these. Good thing they're sold literally everywhere business is done. That's the problem. I don't know if he will. Not this sorry. is it's a really Racist. murky political situation going on between the and Ricky's. Caught in the middle of this whole situation. <laughs> Discover the rainbow. Take uh, the rainbow. It's four hundred and fifty million dollars, uh, Ross, for the next ten years, mate. Who the fuck wouldn't want that money? Uh, MVP, if he came back and became champ, I would be so happy. But unfortunately, it doesn't look like he's coming back anytime soon. Just you. Do as you're damn told. Red Dead Redemption Two coming October twenty sixth. Rated M for mature. Get the PS4 Pro bundle. <laughs> Like leather, skin is stronger when it's hydrated. But 9 out of 10 men don't get the hydration their skin needs. That's why Dove Men Plus Care Body Wash has a unique hydration. Yeah, I heard that one, Ross. Which, which did disappoint me, to be fair. He's had a few opportunities over the last few years to return, actually. 
Kalito's had a few opportunities. Like, when they were making the SmackDown brand, doing the whole brand split again, he was one of the people they called to come back, which was, what was that, 2016? He denied then. He's denied a few times. Which is annoying, because I loved Carlito. This is the loudest snow ever. Mm, debatable on that one because the first run he did was really really good when we were dating we used to get excited about things like concert tickets or a new snowboard but that all changed when we bought a house Voila! matt started turning into his dad mm, that's a good mulch one more but it was pretty nifty when Jim showed me how easy it was to protect our home and auto with Progressive. Get this large scratch out of here. Progressive can't protect you from becoming your parents. It took quite a bit of work, because this was a lot, this is all state. But we can't protect your home and auto when you bundle with us. When you order Domino's... I think they're going on a good path with them, though, right, right now, they're off. Uh, no, Nathan, I can't join the TV. If you want to watch it, I can give you a link. But that's all I can do, mate, because it's copyrighted content in the punch chat. No, uh, Intercontinental, I'd like to see him hold that. Not the one I've heard, Ross. What I've heard, I don't know how they're going to get there, but rumours are circulating that it'll be Dean versus Seth for the Universal title at WrestleMania. One second. That should work for you. Oh uh, God, no, Ross. I think we'll have to turn in next week to figure out. Uh, that should work, Nathan, but it's only on computer, not on mobile. I like how they did a Dean turn. A lot of people are agreeing on how they turned Dean heel last night. Yes, I know it was on a dramatic night with what Roman said, but that was what's best about it. No one knew they were going to pull the trigger that night. The rumour was it was going to be around Survivor Series time that Dean was going to turn. Yeah, exactly. I like it. Roman would have wanted the show to carry on for them to do... Oh, fuck the dumbasses. A lot of people like Shock Factor. That was a Shock Factor last night, Dean turning heel. People didn't expect it. Um, yeah, look, uh, not that much stuff. We, showed, we saw Becky beat up Charlotte in the performance center. Rey Mysterio uh, beat Miz in a match. Fully engaging the bloodthirsty barbaric side. Um, New Day got destroyed by Big Show in the bar. No issues taking Jeff Hardy out before the tournament even takes place. To the leg, here's and now we've got a match between Jeff Hardy and Randy Orton. Seven or at the very least, would Jeff Hardy be in terrible condition? Exactly. We know the loss would have been too predictable as well, Ross. Shane McMahon is very much looking forward to If they'd lost the match, that would have been too predictable that Dean was going to turn. So I love that they did on the title change. Now, Orton stomping away on every body part of Jeff Hardy. I can see Seth coming out as a mega baby face out of this. Like, you betrayed me. You betrayed your friend Roman. Really laying on thick about the fact he betrayed him on such a devastating night. Which Roman would have agreed with that, so I don't have a problem with that. Roman would have signed off on anything to be used by him, I, I believe. Uh, I completely agree, Nathan. I am the same, mate. And is enjoying every Definitely. This, this new Dean Ambrose has been amazing. So he'll take the look at the good for him. Busting my behind night in, night out to make a name for myself. Makes him a mega heel, though, doesn't it? That is exactly what I plan on doing. See, I have respect for Roman Reigns. I just don't really like him that much as a wrestler. But as a man, I do have the utmost respect for him. 
taking his time, methodically breaking down Hardy. Look at this incredible Ooh. athleticism. Right exactly. The they finally did a good fucking decision. For God's sake. Hey, Grace, we talked about it earlier about Rey Mysterio, the condition that he's in, perhaps uh, the one night turn. Exactly. They pulled the trigger when people like were not better. expecting it, which was fantastic. I love, I love the shock factor in my wrestling. Apparently, Elias turned face last night as well. Apparently that Katara attack towards Baron Corbin was him turning face, which I don't disagree with. Elias is fantastic, his face or heel. I'm not bothered because Elias is fantastic. It will not slow him down. His momentum is fantastic. He is one of the best people they've got right now. Over and over and over again, and Orton not stopping. All right, thank you, Nathan. I'll see you next week, mate. Thank you for joining. Official behest. A little sense, maybe in the back of Orton's mind, he wants to finish the job he started with Hardy. You don't need to sense it, Saxton. Randy Orton's all too happy to tell you. Oh no, 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 and the official's count slowing down Orton made him stop. Jesus, Orton is sadistic as hell. I love this character right now. Face first in our desk. Oh, no, no, and Hardy. The fall off of the desk as Hardy bounced. There is no bound. To the viciousness of Randy Orton. Listen. Yeah, I am Ross. That that's a rumor that is circulating right now. Is that's what they're going to be making the main event at WrestleMania, which I completely agree with. But I think now, this Randy comes Orton with factors of time, whether Roman makes it back or not. Yeah, Bobby Lashley is RC champ. That'd be decent. Um, Braun is a universal champion, so I'd say around about fast lane time. Have a good old uh, build after the Royal Rumble. Have a bit of a build for Seth versus Braun. Have Seth be thrown in. Dean, ta Dean manages to. Uh, I'd love the Ascension to hold it or the Revival, either one of them. Yeah, the Ascension have been doing really good lately. I love that. Um, great. Uh, great match between Seth and Braun. Braun gets dethroned due to Ambrose interfering, but backfiring on him because he was trying to cost Seth, but he ended up costing De Ro uh, Braun instead. Braun gets destroyed. Uh, De Dean gets destroyed by Braun. Seth laying out the challenge to Dean, saying. You know what? This is enough is enough. Me, you, WrestleMania, I've even put this on the line. Yeah, punch and towel. Uh, and then they have a WrestleMania match, and then Dean dethrones him, and he gets the Universal Championship. Yeah. That would be pretty decent. Count away from rendering Randy Orton obsolete tonight. Take another look at this whisper in the wind. Hardy's leg crashing right down across the face of Randy Orton. But Orton's still alive here in this matchup. Jeff Hardy trying to build momentum towards Crown Jewel, looking for retribution for Hell in a Cell in the same instance. Twist of fate. That was a stunner for fuck's sake. Hardy maybe one step closer to that retribution. Hardy's looking to go up top. One of the greatest risk takers in the history of WWE. Looks at Swanton Bomb and Orton rolls out. Very, very smart decision by Randy Orton. What the Have fuck is Jeff thinking? Oh my god! Orton rolled out of the way on the floor. And Jeff Hardy just went splat. Look at this. Oh gosh, the, the, the nasty thud of. Hardy's body just call it high risk for a reason. No, he I didn't realize. Actually, I haven't played much of Jeff. Under twist. Yeah. Trying to do whatever he could to take out Orton, but found a three here by the official. That could have been a fatal mistake. 
And get another guy out. Bad shape here. And Orton wants to inflict more punishment. He wants his. Hardy suffering disaster there on the outside, and now it could be the Viper that capitalizes. The Viper going to that place. There's breath in Orton's lungs. There's venom in his heart. As Jeff Hardy's about to find out, a sick smile on Orton's face. Setting up for it, went for the RKO. Wait a minute, backslide. Hardy nearly had him. Going for it again. What's another twist? Oh, RKO! The three most dangerous letters in sports entertainment. Get out of the way. Oh, just checked out some news. Apparently, WWE were hang, handing out We Want Women to Tag Championship signs to fans. So even they are trying to make fans push for the idea, which I don't mind. I like that. And um, I'm not going to spoil 205 Live because I already know the results now. But did you know? Um, Tomorrow marks the 100th episode, 205 Live. Not just a victory over Jeff Hardy, but a message to the entire field of the WWE World Cup Tournament to determine the best in the world. Four from Raw, four from SmackDown Live will compete in a one-night tournament at Crown Jewel. Who will be crowned hmm. the best in the world? Could it be the Viper? Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna know this. This guy did some spoilers. This is how we spelt the guy's name. I think that's meant, I think he's meant to say Hideo Tommy. Is it a Tommy he's having a match with? <laughs> I know that's quite a good spelling there, dude. Let me just check if there's any more wrestling news. Go like. Alright, well, I'm going to head off to bed, mate. It's been a fun night. Tomorrow, remember, it starts at 11pm because we have uh, NXT UK to watch. I don't think that's a bad idea. I just don't know how they'd utilise that much when we're standing there. That's the problem. This is the problem is what they're going to do with that much talent, though. Because, obviously, there's a lot of talent. Raw would probably be the best place because there was a lot of time to fill. So, yeah, I'd, I agree with Raw, but SmackDown, I wouldn't think so much time to have the women featured as much. But obviously, we do get a lot of women's time, but that's probably why they want more women. I like the idea of, of multiple brand women's tag titles. I don't think dual. I think, I think three. I think between... Between NXT, maybe even include UK in this, or at least NXT, SmackDown, and Raw. Between all three of them. Because that way you give women from the developmental brand a chance to shine on the main roster with titles. Which I think is a fantastic idea.
Yeah, I'm going to head off to bed because it's been a long day. Uh, yeah, exactly, Ross. Uh, if you do get a chance to watch me, I, I have uploaded on YouTube the last two live streams I've done, which were um, Burnout Paradise. I'd recommend watching Burnout Paradise on Twitch. So if you're going to watch a replay, because I had to edit out a lot of songs. So there's a lot of, well, a good few, I'd say a good 20 minutes collectively where there's no audio because of that. Uh, and um, Dragon Ball Z Universe 2, which I spent the four hours on today, which if you do get a chance, watch that on YouTube because I could do with the ad revenue for that one. Yeah, just check out some of the past ones. Uh, obviously, Red Dead's coming out Friday. I don't know whether I'll get to play it on Friday because it might take so long to install and everything, so I need to work out space and stuff like that and may have to put that off till Saturday but I will be playing something Friday if it is not Red Dead it would be probably maybe um, what have I been playing lately maybe 2K19, maybe Xenoverse, maybe Burnout Paradise might play a bit of Warframe, something like that, I don't know uh, it is very, very true it's true, it's true, it's damn true we get Red Dead Online. Whether it's on launch, I don't know. I don't know whether it's launched with the game or you just have the single player campaign to start with. But either way, I don't know what it's coming with, but I cannot wait. Yeah, it is coming with online, whether it's on launch, though, like GTA Online came a bit after. I don't know exactly how they're doing it, but... Who knows, we'll have to wait and see. Exactly. Uh, obviously, I can imagine they're going to treat it like GTA Online. Monthly events, loads of stuff to do. Like There's exclusive DLC which come in with my 90 quid edition that actually comes for just online. So, it probably will launch with the game. So, we'll check out the single player, then multiplayer on like a different day. I don't know yet, but we'll have to wait and see. Yes, a lot of Red Dead covering. I'll play a bit more 2K, continue my story, uh, join the next week. Just trying to add a bit of game variety on here, just so people don't get bored of the same thing. So, and I don't get bored, because I did enjoy Xenoverse today. So far. Not from the rumor mill, Ross. The rumor mill is saying that Bully 2 will be the next game that they will be working on. My personal opinion is I don't think we'll see GTA 6 until the brand new consoles come out. Which is probably going to be looking like 2021, 2022. I think Bully will probably be the last Rockstar game to be launched uh, on these consoles. I think we might get GTA 6 on Xbox One and PS4, but I don't think it'd be their definitive version. Like, we got PS3 version of GTA 5, and then they re-released it on PS4, and it was so much better of a game. They put a lot of work into it, so I see it might look, work like that. So yeah, I could see Bully 2 maybe 2020, 2019, something like that. And then, yeah, we'll get that, and then we'll get GTA 6, I think. Which will probably have a massive online component, I think. I think that's how Rockstar is heading towards. Yeah, that's what I see. Because uh, the new consoles... Ow, my neck. Are rumoured to be 2021. That's the rumoured dates for the new consoles. So I could kind of see that being coinciding with GTA. Honestly, I could see it being a launch title for the new consoles. Which is a good idea because I get your new console straight out of the fucking door with a brand decent, brand new decent game to play. But we'll have to wait and see what happens in the future. But all I know is I'm looking forward to Red Dead, which is getting delivered in two days' time. Two fucking days. And then apparently it's got like a 22 gigabyte installation. Oh, I hope they do, Ross. I hope they do drop some news about what's going on with the PS5. I cannot wait to see. Hey, 
it'll probably just be noting that they're working on it and it'll be coming out within the next five years, something like that. They never, never give you too many details early. But anyway, mate, I'm gonna head off to bed now. Fun talking about games with you. I do do enjoy this. It's nice that you're actually awake today. All right, mate, I shall see you at 11 o'clock for NXT UK, which I'm I'm hoping is on this week. Should be a weekly show, right? Yeah, either way, I'll see you tomorrow for NXT, NXT UK, and 205 Live. Now, as always, if any... As, <clears throat> God, intro, outros. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Now, as always, if, if you've enjoyed this stream, please click that follow button. If you've really enjoyed this stream and would like to support, I think so, Ross. I think it is weekly. Uh, I'll check the schedule. To, actually, I could probably check the schedule now for tomorrow. So give me one sec. Uh, wrestling. Not Tyler Bate UK figure. Um, yeah. Schedule. The schedule thing never works. Yeah, I've heard. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, it will be cool for a weekly show because I do love UK wrestling. Now, as always, if you have enjoyed this video, the stream, please click that follow button. If you've really, if you've really enjoyed it and would like to support these future streams, please click that subscribe button or support me on Patreon. Any and all helps. And as always, I shall catch you later.